Let's do connections. We're finding four groups of four. Uh, we've got King Kong, Whoop, Beep Beep, Yahoo, Ding Dong, Har Har, Coco, Hoot, Skirt, Bubbles, Dodo, Purr Again, Yuck, Yo-Yo, Vroom, and George. <laughs> George. Just finish off with George. What is going on here? Okay, so the first thing I'm thinking of is Purr and Vroom could be um what are, what are those called onomatopoeias i think where it's a word that sounds like what it describes like purring and vroom i think skirt might be one of those like skirt i don't know um and ding dong ding dong um beep beep is another one Okay, so I, I'm not going to lock that one in yet because I don't know which ones go with it. Um, I'm also seeing George. I don't know why, but it makes me think of Curious George, the monkey. Isn't Bubbles a monkey as well? Do I know enough monkeys? King Kong's a monkey. Uh, Coco was a monkey. Gorillas. Are they all gorillas? I don't know. Monkey slash gorillas. I, I think I'm going to try this one. It's probably a mistake. It's not. Famous primates, purple first, plus two to purple, really pulling through. I do have Lily sleeping next to me. She's not attached to me, but I guess that's like maybe ranged plus one. Lily helped out. All right. Um, I'm glad George made me think of Curious George there. Okay. So were any of the, none of those were like the onomatopoeias. I hope I'm using the right word there. Uh, yuck. Hmm. Hoot and whoop and dodo. Dodo's a bird. Har har. Ding dong. Beep beep. Whoop. <laughs> what is going on with this one? Yahoo is a search engine, but you can also say Yahoo. You can say whoop. You can hoot. You can hoot and holler. Um, what, what's like the first like, ooh, I'm excited. Uh, Yahoo. Whoop. Hoot. Uh, I don't see it. Har har is like a, a fake laugh. Har har. Um, a yo-yo was on a string. Okay. Vroom, skirt, purr. I think these three are onomatopoeias. I think ding dong's going to go with it. I don't know why. Well, ding dong is also a candy, right? Or is a, 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 you know what I mean? Not a candy, but like a candy pastry thing. That's not going to be the candy. I think whoop, hoot, and yahoo are cries of uh, exclamations of joy. It could be beep, beep, but... I feel like and I'm between ding dong and beep beep actually. And I, I don't, I don't know. It could be that per skirt or, or room go elsewhere. Okay. Could, could skirt be like a homophone for skirt, like the clothing? Are there other like clothing homophones? Yuck, ding dong, beep beep, yo yo, har har. I don't see it. Oh gosh. I mean, we've got har har, beep beep, yo yo, and dodo, which are just the same sound twice. I don't know if that would be a category, but if it was, then that means beep beep is not in that category. So I, I'm gonna I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try ding dong, skirt, vroom, and purr as onomatopoeias. <sighs> one away, of course. And I don't know I don't know which one beep beep replaces. Or it could be whoop or hoot. Maybe it's whoop. I'm going to remove ding dong and put in whoop, actually. I feel like that fits a lot better. I just thought that that would go with cries of exclamation. It does. Okay. I'm just making mistake after mistake. Darn it. I feel like if I thought about this more, I could, I could have done it perfect. This is tough, though. How about yuck? Maybe yuck is the, is the cry exclamation. I'm going to try it. We're going to yahoo, hoot, whoop, and yuck. Okay, I don't have any mistakes left. It is one away, though. So I feel like I'm on the right track for both of those categories. So that means that probably Yuck and Ding Dong go together. And Dodo and Har Har. How does that make sense? No. I, let's see. Per Vroom Skirt. I can't test if these go together, but I think they do, right? Because I tried them with Ding Dong. I tried them with Boot Whoop. And they were one away both times. Now, that, that could technically mean that Ding Dong and Whoop both go in the category. It does mean beep beep doesn't. Uh, does it mean beep beep does go in it? It could be a hoot. 
hoot is is the, is what a owl owl sound. But I tried I tried whoop hoot yahoo and yuck. That was one away. And it, it, my assumption is yuck was wrong. Oh no. <laughs> uh, I wonder how many people got purple first and then failed. <laughs> like me. Um Dodo is an extinct bird. Yo-Yo Ma is a cello player. Yo-Yo is a thing on a string that goes up and down. I feel like yuck, 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 like that's kind of like a fake laugh. Har har is kind of a fake laugh. But like, what are the other fake laughs? Perv room, Yahoo. No, perv room skirt. You know what? I want to put beep beep in here. Because I think these are all um, sounds that you might make when playing with like a toy truck. The beep beep is backing up. Skirt is like skirt, like your your um, what what's that called? Yeah, uh, I'm forgetting the name of it. When your wheels go the wrong way. <laughs> um, why can't I think of that word? Anyway, vroom, like vroom, vroom, and then like purr of the engine. It's this or it's nothing. Okay, car onomatopoeia. Got it. Okay. So now we're down to, we know that whoop, yahoo, and hoot, and yuck. That was one away. What are we doing here? <laughs> um, one of these is supposed to be yellow. I feel like this is yellow, like the, the cry exclamations, but is it like yo-yo? <laughs> what would ding-dong, har-har, and dodo have to do with each other, though? Ding dong, the witch is dead, witch old witch, the wicked witch. They're not all candies, are they? If they are, I haven't heard of half of them. And that's going to be a problem if they're name brands. Which means I need to figure out... Okay, this was one away. Ahu hoot whoop. I know Whopper is a candy. I don't think whoop is. Hoot. I think it's these three. You hoot and holler. You whoop. You yahoo. You... Har har? I don't see how har har would be a candy, so I don't know. I'm going to I have to do something. I'm going to do this. Please. Well, a knucklehead? Hold on. A ding dong, a dodo, a yahoo and a yo-yo are knuckleheads. And then sounds of laughter, har har, hoot, whoop, yuck. I did say laughter at some point, but these are not sounds of laughter. Har har and yuck, I had isolated as sounds of laughter, but hoot and whoop being sounds of laughter? I disagree. Who hoots and whoops when they're laughing? Uh, maybe an owl. Um, I've heard ding dong and dodo more often as, as someone who's like um, not all there in the head. Um, Yahoo and yo-yo meaning that? I don't know. You could convince me that was true, but I feel like I'm being gaslit by, by these two categories. All right. Um, yeah, I, I, for, the, for the entire time, I, I, I was sure who Whoop and Yahoo went together. I don't think I stood a chance of picking these out. Really hard one today. I'm going to, I don't know, uh, 4.5? Let's see what they say. 3.2, there's no way. Not a chance it's 3.2. Let's look at the bot. 34% uh, solve rate, 5 out of 5 difficulty. Now, I am doing this a little early, so we're, we're missing most Americans, but still, that is, like, yeah, look look at this graph, right? This graph is a straight line, which tells me people are guessing. Okay. Good job to the 9% of players who made no mistakes. Um, Yeah, I am a completely unique. I'm not surprised. I did get purple. And green. I got purple and green. All right. Purple first, really common, because, yeah, they're the only ones that aren't just random sounds. Uh, some people got green first. That's really nice. Um, second, so this is among players who won, right? So second, people are are getting green second, or, per, or some of them are getting blue second. So how about ever? Yeah, uh, blue and yellow are both at 35, 36%. So people just, yeah, how do you split those up? Okay, what's the more details? I don't really 
So a quarter of all people got nothing right. 15%, which is the second most common, is just getting purple. 9% just got green. 8% just got green and purple. Or actually, if we add these together, 15% got just got green and purple. So 25, 15, 9, 8, 7. I'm going to add that up. Give me a second. 25 plus 15 plus 9 plus 8 plus 7. 64 percent of people only got green and purple or, or less. Crazy. Purple first, very common though. All right. Um, yeah, whoop, yahoo, har har, hoot, aud audible exclamations, beep, beep, hoot, skirt, automobile noises, hoot, maybe? I don't know. Like, I, I, I was thinking for things like this is just like onomatopoeias. Right. Beep, beep, ding, dong, har, har, yo, yo. This is just repeated. I'm glad I didn't fall for that trap, at least. Ding, dong, skirt, per room, sound. Yeah, just onomatopoeias, onomatopoeias. People are trying to figure out what the onomatopoeias are. I'm not surprised. Um, what are the sounds of excitement? What are the onomatopoeias? I don't know. Um, so, yeah. Joyful expressions and vehicle noises. No, just... <laughs> okay. Um... Most commonly, purple first. All right, I don't know what to do with that info. Cool. Well, um, how'd you do? Let's do the mini crossword for Monday, October 7th. Let's go. Spill the beans to, uh, to say the thing. Um, to, I don't know. Bird that has been used by the Dutch police to take down illegal drones. I don't know. Which bird? Online shopping. Yeah, okay, I do that. With three down, nope, try another guess. Schedule blank, modern email button. Schedule send, maybe? Root veggies in borscht. Ah, uh, I don't know. Carpenter's shaping tool. An edge? No, that's, that's too short. A square. No, that's too long. Um, yeah, what? See, like three mice in a nursery rhyme, blind. Big beast in Banff National Park. I don't even know what Banff National Park is. Big beast, though, that's three letters. It's not a bear. Um, some kind of big cat or a wolf or... I don't know. Can I get any of these? Spill the beans. Blab, maybe? Um, so let's look at the downs again, maybe. Root veggies. Beets, maybe? Carpenter shaping tool with an L, maybe. I don't know. A lathe? Um, with three down. Nope. Try another guess. Think again. And apparently we have an eagle. The eagles are being used by the police. Online shopping. E. Well, this is elk. Oh, and I solved it. E tail. I've never heard e tail in my life. It's retail, but it's e dash tail. I get it. Never heard that in my life. <laughs> I feel like maybe e tail would be like the name of one of those dating apps. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, did I miss any of these? Blab, eagle, e tail, think, send. Oh, no, I got them. Cool. Well, how'd you do? Let's do strands for October 7th. Today's theme is most excellent. Excellent. Um, I hope this isn't as hard as the other games today. <laughs> I'm beat already. Um, let's see. I'm just going to look for words because, yeah. Pets? Most excellent? Oh, come on, they are. Um, I mean, are we just talking about success, right? Something along those lines. Things that are good. Um, Bill and Ted's most excellent adventure. Let's look around the edges more carefully. Um, CH. Like, what would we do from CH? Would it end of the word? I don't see it. PH, pit, pet. And that's where I saw pets. I should have realized it wouldn't be it because there's two ways. Step. Pets backwards. Oh, there's also still two ways for that. Um, we have a VY groove or something can't quite do groove i see i yeah we can't do o-o-v-e but for some reason my brain's seeing it this why why is like to be at the end of words worry worry without with another r um i keep wanting to do lasso 
I know it's there should be an A for lasso, but boss something. Wait, boss locked in. Oh, like you're a, you can call someone a boss. Like oh, you're a boss. Like you're you're doing you're good. So is this like slang for like someone like complimenting someone? Um, oof. All of it have left my brain. Just every single slang for for slang compliment has has left my brain now. Um, I gotta keep looking then. Well, I think about what are okay. What would you call someone who's doing well? Um, you're a boss. You're the goat. <laughs> is goat here? Um, maybe it's like pet names or pet. What would it be? I'm 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 thinking pet is actually used here. Pet like as the spanagram. But I don't know what it would be. You have double L here. Real? That uh, doesn't isolates the G. Uh, gory. <laughs> um. Great. Great. Great something. Maybe that's the spanagram. Okay. Well, if great is part of a spanagram, we can look around what that isolates. Um. Swoovy. <laughs> Is it just groovy? There we go. It's groovy. Um, oof. So the spanogram goes left to right, which which makes me think pet might be correct. But so what goes here? S W E L D A. What's like welda? <laughs> um, swell. Okay. Is it D A or is it like oh is is it da I thought it might be daddy uh, or is it does it end in A D somehow so we got T H A S D and A D kind of around here that's maybe that's Dan oh dandy dandy okay now we have this that's cool I think it's that's cool that's cool. That's our spanogram. Okay, so it wasn't pet at all. Um, now we got this kind of thing going on here. Three more. Um, okay, so it's words for that's cool. It's not what you would call someone. It's it's a word you'd use for cool. So like that's groovy. It's swell. It's dandy. It's boss. It's awesome. I don't know. <laughs> um, it's krigged. Uh, ghetto is two T's. Okay. Um, it's pesot. <laughs> huh. Cheech. <laughs> what if C-H-Y is the ending to something? I don't see it, though. Are we doing, like, C-R-I somehow? Are we doing C-H and then, like, this I-R is isolated? Well, not isolated, but I-R... R-I, maybe? Rig? Right? Righteous. Righteous. Wow, we still have two more words here. Um, so they're short. <laughs> These letters don't make any sense together. Uh, cho? Che che chechi. No. Um, what's this, like, P-E? Yif. Choice? Can I do choice? Yes, I can. Choice. And Effie? Phi? Hype, hype. Wow. Okay, so what do we end up with? Um, groovy, boss, swell, dandy, hype, righteous, and choice. Okay. It's old slang, but it checks out. <laughs> well, how'd you do? <laughs> Thank you.